Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing snack crate. Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> um, I love snack trait, snack trait, nope, snack crate. Um, and I enjoy finding treats that I like from other countries. So if you're interested in seeing what I got in my box today, uh, just hang out and watch my video. All right, so I haven't even opened this box. Um, I'm opening right now. First reactions are gonna be with you. Let's see. <gasps> Canada! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's a cute little moose on the back of this one. I'm really excited. Canada, oh, Canada. I don't know why it's saying that. You're welcome. All right, <sighs> cool. So this tells us what we've got. And, oh, it's like got this cute little Canada sticker holding it on. I love that. And I'm about to rip it. Oh, I didn't rip it, good. All right, the okay. first thing that we've got out of the box are these old Dutch ketchup chips. Ketchup chips. I feel like I've heard that before, but it still sounds weird. Um, it's gluten-free, so that means something, right? It doesn't really say anything about it. What does this say about it? Let's see, ketchup chips. These famous Canadian chips are the perfect mix of savory and salty flavors with a hint of sweetness that makes them irresistible. All right, well, I think that we need to try these today, right? We'll pick a few and try them. This is a smaller box for some reason. I'm not sure what happened there, um, but I'll find out. <laughs> Maybe when I find out, I'll put it below if you care to know. All right, the next thing we have is a Ruffles All Dressed Potato Chips. They apparently love potato chips in Canada. Um, all dressed, what does that mean? Made with paprika and a secret blend of spices. Ooh, fancy. All right. And then we've got some Doritos Zesty Cheese. These see, feel very American. I don't know if you can see them. Yeah, you can see them. You know it's my video when I am trying to hold up things on this side when the camera's on this side. I'm sorry guys, eventually I'll figure this out, right? There, let's try it like that. <laughs> Those say these chips feature a blend of Parmesan and cheddar cheeses with a deliciously tangy kick. There's the kick for ya. These are cute, okay. Humpty Dumpty Ringolos barbecue flavor. They look like some type of corn chip, maybe. Yeah, like a, like a Fritos kind of deal. Maybe we'll try these. We'll see, I wonder if there's anything other than chips in here. Oh yeah, okay. This is a super passion flaky, that's all it is, a super passion flaky. Uh, like a pastry dough? What's it say about this? These light and sweet Canadian favorite features flaky pastry filled with fruit, jelly, and cream. I'm not a, fran a fan of fruit things like that, so I don't think we'll be trying that. In fact, my mom will probably want that, so I'll save that for her. Let's see. Maynard's Juicy Squirt Berries. They have a jelly in the middle, so they're kind of like, what's that called? I'll think of it when I'm not recording. That's what's gonna happen. Uh, these soft and shareable snacks gummies are filled with a sweet splash of fruit flavor in every bite. I wanna try these today, cause those look yummy. All right. Some Thrills gum. It, ta it still tastes like soap. What? It still tastes like soap? Why does it say that? <laughs> It still tastes like soap is a strange but endearingly Canadian description for this rose-watered 
flavored chewing gum. I hate rose. It's gross. But I'll try it today. Just remind me not to try it as my last one. Yikes. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, it's a maple um, sucker. But I don't like maple, but this is really cute. This is quintessentially Canadian treat. This quintessentially Canadian treat is made of 100% pure maple syrup. What more could you ask for? Look at that. Look at how cute it is. Aw. I'm going to give that to somebody as a gift. Maynard's Fuzzy Peaches. These are also a gummy snack. Sweet, chewy peach flavored gummy slices. Packed with flavor and made with real fruit juice. Ooh. That's cool. There's just a few more things in here. I see one I'm really excited about. This isn't it. This is not it. This is not it. Glosset Raisins. <laughs> Grab your favorite movie and this favorite snack. Sweet raisins drenched in creamy milk chocolate. I like raisins by themselves. I don't like them in food. I don't like them dipped in chocolate. Yikes. So I think we're about a half for a half here. Ooh, this feels very hard though. Macintosh's Creamy Toffee. Enjoying Canada for over 100 years, Macintosh's Toffee is known for being not too hard and not too soft. It feels really, you hear that? It feels very hard, but I love toffee, so that's exciting. All right, and then our last thing, I've definitely heard of these before because they have them in other parts of the world as well. Smarties, essentially other parts of the world's M&Ms. So I'm excited about that. Yay. All right, so that's all we've got in this box. Um, I think for sure I'm gonna try these ketchup chips first. Let's see how they do. They don't open, that's how they do. Ah, got it. Okay. It legitimately smells like french fries with ketchup. This is so weird. I don't know how I'm gonna like this. All right, I got a small one to try first. A fly just flew in my face. That's so rude. Mmm. It tastes like a fry with ketchup. No, it's not too sweet. It's, um... It's got the, like, very salty flavor. It doesn't taste like Heinz ketchup for us Americans that know. It tastes kind of like an off-brand ketchup, if that makes sense. It's got... A little bit of a kick to it, but it probably wouldn't have a kick for anybody else. I just am very sensitive to kicks. All right, I'm going to do one more. I'm going to do a bigger one now. <laughs> okay. Oh, I can't open my mouth that wide. Hmm. Okay. I don't hate it. It's not my favorite thing in the world, but I don't hate it. So... That's good. Let's see. Should I try the nasty gum now? I'm sorry, I'm not giving it a fair chance. It might not be nasty. But I have a strong feeling that it is gonna be nasty. I'll try it anyways, it's just a... Oh yeah, this is what it looks like beforehand. Pop one out. Doesn't really smell. I gotta get the ketchup out of my mouth. All right, here we go. Cheers. Uh-uh. It really tastes like soap, guys. Don't do it. Yeah. I don't like that. Yikes. 
if there's anybody below or anybody watching anybody below if there's anybody watching that uh does like the taste of soap message me and i'll give you these gum this gum oh that was a regret i have now yikes uh what else can i try to get that flavor out of my mouth all right let's go with these gummies oh my nards i like saying that all right let's find us gummy i'm gonna do a grape one they're a little sticky gushers that's what the word is and that's exactly what they're like but gushers taste really fake and these this it tastes like grape it doesn't taste like um just a fruit flavor let's try a cherry one now That tastes like medicine. Tastes like straight up Robitussin. Weird. Is that all the flavors they have? Hmm. Oh, they have an orange one. Okay. I think it's orange. Okay, so that, sorry, I'm reading the package. Uh-oh. Thank goodness I read this. Someone remind me from now on to read the ingredients of things. Um, the, the grape, and then they have the cherry that I just tried, and then this is peach raspberry, and then they have one that is strawberry key lime, and I'm allergic to lime, so that would have been a mistake I made. But thankfully, um, I didn't do that, so... Mmm. And peach raspberry is the best out of all of them. Oh my goodness. I really like that. A lot. Yum. I might search for all the peach raspberry ones in there. Anyways, um, that's all I'm going to try today. <laughs> and I'm not like super, super impressed with this box, to be honest. Um... I mean, Canada's so close to us and we have so many of the same kinds of things that it just felt a little Americanized to me, but that's okay. It's not a bad thing. Um, to somebody else, it might be like super different from what they're used to. So um, that's cool. Uh, let me know below if you've tried any of these before and what you thought of them, especially this soap gum. That's such a weird thing. Um, Anyways, I hope that you enjoyed me doing my unboxing and I hope that you will think about subscribing wherever I put it and um, liking this video. Um, and if you do like it, if you could just share it with your friends, that would be great. I'm trying to build up my um, subscribers. So help a sister out, subscribe, invite your friends. And um, I think there's a giveaway over on my other last video. So maybe I'll try to attach that here. We'll see how that goes. I don't know how to work things. I don't know how to do things. So <laughs> we'll see. Anyways, uh, thanks for joining me. And I will see you next time.